Hi, I'm Natasha. I'm going to explain um, how to how I would describe to a child in a classroom that has come from maybe another country and doesn't know about our cultural or has just come from different beliefs or tradition when sitting in a classroom and how to act. So, because some kids, they can be rambunctious and they're like, well, it's okay if I do this or it was okay that I did this when I was in my old school and sometimes you have to sit down with them and be like, well, it's not okay when you're in the classroom here. And so, when it's a nonverbal time like reading time or um, not lecture time when it's a child child like an elementary schooler or something but in a kid is just sitting there being rambunctious and he's like oh it's fine I don't have to listen you kind of have to sit there and explain to him and you have to sit and show him what's appropriate for class and what's not appropriate for class and sometimes it takes more than one try like you can't just automatically think that a kid is going to understand and listen to you the first time like it sometimes they they're gonna want to rebel against you and they're not gonna want to listen the very first time but there's other kids that you can ask to like show them the correct ways to do things and you can get help from other little kids by being like can you be an example and can you like show them that it's like you get rewarded sometimes for doing the right thing and so when you're behaving non-verbally you like you sit quietly and you're not like sitting there rolling your eyes and like trying to talk to your neighbor and it's just like being polite and all this other and all the other things that when you're supposed to be respectful to your teacher and so I hope you enjoy and thank you.